Hello guys, welcome back to the Trevor Tips and in this video we're going to talk about how to fix that screen is not working on your iOS 16 after update and how we can completely fix this up. This is actually right now happening for many of the users and we're going to talk about how we can fix this up. So that is you just have to follow these instructions and first one is all about you have to, be, uh, you have to uh, use initial text location. So that is the first thing which you have to try. So that I have to tap on settings first. Now from here I have to tap on accessibility. Now I have to tap on touch. Now from here I have to tap on touch accommodation. So here I have to tap on it and I have to enable this one. I have to enable touch accommodation. And right now what I have to do is I have to enable this one. Once it is done, I have to use initial touch screen. Now go for OK you'll be getting a message like this and it is done and if you scroll down as you can see there is an option also called swipe gestures you have to tap on this one and you have to enable this also when you enable this you'll be getting this kind of option like this so you have to set this to standing right so this is the first step which you have to do and once it is done most probably the issue has to be fixed and even after trying this if it's still not working the next is all about the issue must be based on two things the first one you have to make sure that your screen as well as your hands are not having oily or it is not having contaminated with the waters that be the issue why the touch screen is not working even you make sure that you are not having any oily things on your bare hand as well as on the screen it is not oily it is not having any water content you are completely removed with everything and it is all good and the next is all about you have to make sure that the issue is not with the tempered glass as you can see we all use tempered glass for the protection so you have to remove it and you have to see whether you are able to fix the issue or not even after trying this if it's still not working the next is all about you have to reset old network settings for that you just have to tap on settings okay you have to tap on settings you have to tap on general from here you just have to scroll down and you have to tap on transfer reset iphone go for reset and you have to go for reset all settings after that you just have to check whether you are able to fix the issue or not most probably that has to be fixed but in some cases it won't so we have value to do solution the next is all about you have to force restart your iphone for that you just have to press volume up followed by volume down Press and hold power button and it's not until you see the Apple logo and most probably the issue has to be fixed, right? Even after trying with all these things, initializing the touch screen, I mean, uh, touch, initialize the touch and you're removing the old things, water, dirt and all those things, but you're still stuck and you're really, literally hating every minute of your life. The next is all about, we have to downgrade from iOS 16 to the lower versions. I suggest you can go for 15 and most probably the issue regarding this has to be fixed and this is how you can fix this up and I hope this video is helpful and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification. See you soon in the next video. Peace out. Bye bye.